Okay, so thank you, Mambili Alba. One sentence lang talaga. <laughs> Ageho, next po. Ageho can relate to as a teacher. Okay, Ma'am Paz, would you like to share? Sabi ko dito ang mga circles ko kasi kahit nakapalit yung students, still non-stop teaching learning process, both students and the teachers. Galing. Palapakan po natin si Ma'am Paz, si Ma'am Mayet. Okay, who else po? Okay, who else po? Okay, Ma'am Elo, nag-recite na po si Ma'am Mayet, si Ma'am Paz. Yung iba na lang po ang hindi pa. <laughs> Okay, Sir Will. Yung ang drawing kasi nang hinaya ko sa paper. Okay po. Ang nakikita ko dyan, parang exposed size and different situations. So, this set. Yes, sir. Parang this set, this is a teacher, sometimes overwhelming yung mga ginagawa namin sa paligid. Misa naman, tayo nakaka-overwhelm sa mga bata sa paligid. Wow, ang galing. <laughs> okay, thank you, Sir Will. Sir Will, palapakan po lang, Sir Will. Okay, so masanay po tayo po malakpak. Okay, so para papalapakan din po tayo. Okay, next po. Okay, wala pong exemption. <laughs> okay, Ma'am Maricel. Okay. Okay, so for the Circle at Center, I'm a little bit uh, smaller than students around me. But uh, there are many students around me hoping that these students can be bigger than I am someday. Wow. <laughs> Galing. Okay, so. My uh, uh, skills and uh, the knowledge and skills uh, that I want them uh, to develop. That's okay. Right. So, Ma'am Placid is more on influence. Ang galing. Okay, so thank you, Ma'am P. Who else po? Sir Carl? Ano pong masasabi niyo? <laughs> Same idea ba sa nabanggit? Okay, I'll say. <laughs> Same idea. Who else? Uh, Sir Gilbert, may dadagdag po kayo. Okay. Um, ako sir, dito sa malaking blue circle, ah, yes, it represents sir. me, tapos yung surrounding small circles, students. So, dyan, for me, ako yung teacher, ang um, willing to impart my knowledge to them. Tapos, dito naman sa isa, malaking circle na purple, yan na yung students ko na na-mold ko to become a professional na quite a bit better than me. Wow! Okay. <laughs> Pala ko po natin Sir Gilbert. Okay, galing na Sir Gilbert. Okay, so who else? Okay, Ma'am Jude, may dadagdag ka po. Ako uh, sir, parang okay lang sa kanila, pero para sa akin, yung small, small circle sa kanila, sa first yung speaker, Exactly. Wow. Galeng. Ang imam Jude emphasizes humility, submissiveness. Galeng. Okay. So, kung baga We are only humans. Okay, who else? So, may dagdag. So, Justin, may dagdag ka? Sir, hindi yung mga ako. Po? Hindi yung mga ako. Ah, yes sir, yung mga sagot. Okay, ba, ba, ah, ako. Yes sir. Yung mga akin po, yung sa first one, yung may maliit na ended, malalaki. Are you sure naka-play ito? Yes, yes. Parang hindi. For a while, sir. Ay, ay, ay. Yes sir, ako. Yung may malalaking circle po, uh, for me, yung malalaking circle, it represents the teacher. And then yung maliit sa gitna would be the students. Because it takes a village to raise a child. Okay. Meanwhile, dito naman po sa maliliit, it seems that yung malaking purple naman sa gitna would be the teacher. And then surrounded by students depending on the teacher. Wow! wow. Okay. okay, so Ma'am Ned, would you like to add? So thank you so much for your opinions. Actually, there are thousands of connections. Okay, marami po tayong pwede masabi dito. Okay, so unang-una po dito ay this one. Okay, possibly nga. Okay, this one represents represents a teacher. Okay, so teacher, a teacher. Okay, then. The teacher can what? 
can inspire more, no? I mean, so can inspire more students. I mean, so with this influence, I mean, so with these ones, or any, any explanation that you want. Now, ang gusto lang ma-anong sa inyo is this circle, and this circle is what? Is it is there a smaller circle or are they the same circle? The same circle. They are? Yes. Yes, they are the same circle. Same size po yan. Are they magkasinlaki po yan? Are they yung circle po na yan? Okay, na ano lang po, medyo... Okay, so um, we call that as visual illusion. Okay, so now what does this mean as a picture? Okay, so minsan, okay, uh, minsan akala natin ay tayo ay masyadong mataas. Okay, uh, kumbaga sa isang klaso, makala natin tayo yung tayo yung mataas. Okay, so katulad dito. Okay, so katulad dito. Okay, so now, na, kung hindi natin na mapalaya, na paglaki ng mga bata natin, Okay, ang tingin na, ang tingin na, ang tingin na nila sa atin ay parang ganito na lang. Okay, but technically, we are what? We are all the same because we are all humans. Kaya uh, wag tayo mga kamang sa baka, okay, just continue inspiring, okay, so our students. And keep on learning. Of course, to keep on learning, okay, we are reminded by the Department of Education and the order. Okay, uh, number, uh, Department of Education, Memorandum number 8, Series of 2023. Okay, this is a new memorandum. Okay, so reminding its teacher or its administrator and each one. Okay, so for this multi-year guidelines on the resource-based performance management system uh, for building professional standards for teachers. Okay, so ito po yung bago. Okay, this covers full year 2022. 2023, 2024, and 2024, 2025. Okay, so ang coverage po niya ay, okay, so three school years po, okay, starting this school year. Then there are four pages, okay, so that's what's the Okay, now, so may kutiya na ako tayo RPMS side. So we have here phase one. Okay, now for the phase one here, okay, we have here to conduct the following activities. Then, we have here the tools. Then, uh, the persons responsible na dito, and then the schedule. Okay, now, so yung phase one, dapat the month before the start of classes. So, dapat meron pa yung meeting. Anong pa, anong gagawin natin? We need to what? To discuss the RPMS. Kailan po yun? Okay, a month before the start of classes. Okay, so then, okay, second one, okay, first to second month, anong gagawin ng first quarter? Okay, so ang gagawin natin is what? Self-assessment with the initial or individual development planning. So ano kailangan natin? Kailangan meron tayo ang ISA. Ang ginagawin natin is ISA. Okay, so first to second one. Or then uh, we have here the individual performance commitment and review form or the IPCRF. Okay, together with what? Together with the IDP or individual development plan. Ang tanong, meron lang po ba kayo nito? Of course, wala wala. Kakapigilan ng ESA. Meron din yung bago. Dito, phase 1, Raiders Walking Ball. Dito naman ay Raiders. Okay, so phase 2. Ang phase 2 natin is within the school year, once every quarter. So, anong sabi niya? Once every quarter, ano daw ang gagawin? Classroom observation. Ang ibig sabihin, meron tayong apat na Okay, that's an observation next school year. Okay, so ano lang, ang ngayong school year lang daw ay dalawa lang. Okay, ngayong school year. Pero next school year and the next school year, okay, so tiga-iisa na, once every quarter. So anong nagawin natin? I-accomplish natin yung PMCF, or we call that as the Performance Monitoring and Coaching Form. So sinong involve? Ratings and Ratings. Okay, at least once every quarter. So, ito po yan. Tapos, maraming tayo ng media review and assessment. And so, kailan to? Within the fifth to sixth month of the school year. Ibig sabihin, palahagi ng school year, last one, ang ito, sixth month, ang ito, or bago month, and kailangan, mayroon tayo ano, media review. At ito, so, yun yung sinabi niya. Then, phase three, ang gagawin natin is, Okay, kailan gagawin yung phase 3? At least a week after the scheduled graduation. Phase 3 po yun. So, one week pa kung mag-graduation, kailangan meron tayo yung ano? Performance, assessment of teachers. Okay, so anong, anong meron tayo dapat? Kung dapat meron na tayong 
portfolio. At alam mo, mayroon na ka tayong portfolio? Okay, wala nang wala pa. Okay, sa iyo po yun. Okay, let's face three po. Okay, sino ang involved? Raiders, Raiders, at saka approving authorities. Phase 4, ito na po yun, at least a week after naman ng graduation. At least a week after graduation, ano kailangan natin? Kailangan finalize na yung alin. Individual development plan. Sa aking pagkala, ang papaliwanan po nito ay si Ma'am Pass. May technique si Ma'am Pass na i-relay sa atin. Okay, then submission of IPC agad. Kailangan nakasubmit na po tayo. Kailan daw? At least a week after scheduled graduation. Kailangan masabit masa na po yan. Then, ang English dapat na yung IPC after. At least a month after the scheduled graduation. Yan po yung phase 1, phase 2, phase 3, at saka phase 4. Okay, so then, okay, ang ating mode of class of observation ay, okay, so, ay ano daw? Should be what? In person or face to face. Yun lang po yung mode of observation. Okay, nagkakaroon lang ng ganito kung may ano, kung may ano, kung class suspension. Pwede yung uh, online synchronous, okay, so online asynchronous, okay, pwede pong ganun, or, okay, during lock session. Pero wala naman yan, kasi yung face to face na tara. Okay, so, now, ang um, sino ang rate ni writer natin? Pag lead picture or master teacher, ang rate ni namin, ang writer ay si Sir Kendo, yung principal ko. Okay, ang mag-approve ay si Superintendent, kapag small and medium. Mga ano po ang CJAS? Nasa, uh, ano po yan, sir? Uh, division of Quezon City. Nice Hindi school. Ako. Hindi po school yan. Division po mismo. Ah, okay, so... May use pa ni mga assistant superintendent, si na Sir Padilla. Ngayon si Sir Ilan. Uh, so, ASDS. Okay. Uh, so, large sa ano? Large school. Okay, so pag teacher, ang inyong rater ay si uh, teacher with no master teachers. Hindi school na ba kaya yan? Division mismo. Opo. Pag wala, ang nakalili dito ay kapag wala ng master teacher, yung maring siguro ko na school. Okay, sa teacher naman, ang mag-rate ay si no si master teacher, team teacher, or assistant, principal. Okay, so yun yung posibleng... Ang in teacher ba mo? Kahit si no? Basta in teacher. Ah, alam po. Uh, or kayo na mismo yung naka-align, so stop subject. Okay, so, ibig sabihin na patawagin nyo dapat ay si Mamelon at saka yung assistant principal. Excuse Mom, me, sir. Mang Pulode. Meron po talaga kayo assistant principal? Ah, assistant principal. Ah, assistant principal. Ah, ano lang yun? Dawa ka walang ang kami. Hey, everything everything is recorded. Si Sir Barcelona bahala dyan. Kaya di na pa nagsabi. Kaya nga, siya rin nagsabi. Bahala ka dyan, Sir. Okay, may tanong po. Okay, so this time, kapaliwanan na namin yung RBNS tool, okay, for teachers 1 to 3, for this school year. Okay, so for this school year po, ay uh, dalawa lang ang observation ng kailangan. So, RBMS. Ano nga alam sabihin ng RBMS? Ano nga? Ano nga alam sabihin? Ano nga alam sabihin? Ano nga alam sabihin? RBMS? Are they are? Revise ba? Hindi. Okay, suggesting mo lang. Suggesting mo lang. Okay, results? Performance. Results based performance. Manage. So, mayroong crowd 1, crowd 2, crowd 3, crowd 4, and crowd 5. Ang magpapagawa ko ng crowd 1 ako po, crowd 2, 1, 3, si Ma'am Paz, kay crowd 4 and 5, si Ma'am Classy po po. Sila for Classy po po ang magpapagawa na ito. So, for crowd 1, again, so we are on content knowledge and pedagogy. Okay, now for content knowledge and pedagogy, okay, so, kailangan meron na po kayong, ano po, form. Okay, may may inform na po ba sila, ma'am? Hindi mo ko kayo na ako. Ayaw ko ba yan, ma'am? Opo. Wala siya na nag-ibig pa na ako, eh. 
Yung mga lalagyan na ng ano? Yeah. Yung para sa video ng review for? Wala pa po. Wala pa. Okay, so reminders lang pa kung paano gagrigan yung sarili o kung paano makigrigan si Ma'am Ellen sa atin. <laughs> okay, sa so, objective one, okay. Baka mamaya yung form na yun, para baka mamaya sabihin na naman yung ikay mag-device para yung nangyari sa mga kapatid. Okay, ganyan din. Kaya ang tabal. Ganyan din. Kaya lang mo yun mga mas. Diyos ko. Don't worry, isa ako yan sa mga victim na yan at pagmado na Okay, so for objective one Okay, for objective one, ito po yan Content knowledge and pedagogy Okay, so number one is Applied knowledge of content within and across curriculum So, ano ang titingnan po natin dito? RICOT, ito po yan Yung classroom observation tool na pinamahan na ating department head So, titignan nyo po kung ano ang grade nyo. Kung ang grade nyo doon ay agay 7, okay, so kung 7, automatic kayo ay outstanding. So, ilalagay nyo doon sa grade nyo, 5. Okay, so for quality. Okay, now for efficiency, okay, so 5 pa rin, ilalagay nyo. Kung 5 to, automatic 5 din ang tapo. Okay, so ano yan, uh, quality and efficiency, ay magkapatid yung dalawa niya. Pero ewan pa, may ganyan-ganyan pa. Okay, so paano ang gagawin? Sa ilang, ilang observers kayo? Mayroon kayong tatlo? Okay, kung tatlo ang observer, anong gagawin? Okay, so kukuha ng inter observer at gagawin nyo na. Okay, uh, ipoconvert kung ano yung score nyo doon, COT, lalagyan nyo kung anong equivalent niya dito. Okay, so kung ang equivalent niya, Okay, dito, okay, so 4, okay, kung yung nag-observe na isa ay 4, 3, 3, 3, then uh, added, divided by, divided by 4, kung apat ang nag-observe, then yung average, then yun yung rating mo na ilalagay ito. Okay, so kung 4, so BS. Okay, so... Para yung thesis, yung mga nag-observe, para sa objective 1. Okay, so... Kung titingin kayo sa objective ba uh, kuha ninyo Okay, so kung ano yung dem demonstrate pa niya ay 7 Okay, 7 Pag 7 is outstanding Okay, so paano ang grade ng isang ano? Isang observer ay Ano? 6 So kuha nyo ngayon nyo Ah, the rates Ah, ito ang sabihin niya, rating sheet 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 
Apo, ang sabi naman dito, si OT or Inter Observer. Okay, yun nga. Kung ganun ang ginawa nila, hindi ganun nga. Kasi so, kasi nga sa board. Wala lang yan, average. Kasi kung Inter Observer, agreement ko na natin sa sila ba? Opo. Pag pag paibang lalagay mo, ibig sabihin 7 yung binigay sa iyo. Okay, kapag ang binigay sa iyo ay 6, BS lalagay mo. Ay so 4 ang ilalagay mo. So po yung subjective 1. So lahat 'yan, lahat ng may COT, ang ano is inter observer form or the average. Okay, ganun lagi 'yan. Okay, next objective 2, ay yung obvious. Kailangan pala may attachment kayo. Okay, kailangan may attachment kayo. Una, COT form. Okay, pangalawa, mamayroon tama, no? Attachment. COT form, una. Pangalawa, pakiattach yung DLL. Okay, so, kailangan may DLL. Okay, so, then, ang okay, instructional materials, highlighting what? Objective number one. Okay, kailangan nandun yung part ng DLL. Wherein, mayroon kayong ano? Mayroon kayong integration ng ano? Mayroon kayong integration na content within and across curriculum. Okay, parang kami harapan. Hindi pong lesson plan na yata sa mo. Okay, so... Kasi nakalagay lang dito, instructional materials, highlighting. Kung ang materials mo ay activity sheet, parang hindi, yun ang yata sa mo. Okay, sa DLL. Okay, kailangan may attachment sa DLL kung anong instruction materials ang ginamit mo. Now, integration is usually, ano ito eh? Okay, group activities. Okay, usually group activities ito. Okay, so, yun yun. Then, another one is performance task or test material. Highlighting integration of content knowledge within and across the group. Performance task or test material. Sandali ka, Integration of content and knowledge in general across the meaning. Uh, naka, ano yun sa ibang sa sa English at sa mga sa mga parang gano'n sa ibang subjects. Okay. Tama po. Naka-integrate dapat saan? Naka-integrate sa ibang? Okay. Within and across eh. Kaya yun ang tinitignan ko first si pag ano, pag sa mga nandilero. Yun ang tinitignan ko kapag yung ano niya. Yung content eh nakalink with other areas of learning. Okay, anong example sa lesson plan, DLL, ng ano, in, uh, with din na na cross-curriculum? Anong example ko? Uh, sa digestive system namin, it's pwede siya ipapos sa PA. PE. 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 Kailangan naka-ano pa, naka-identify. Na, PE kasi. Uh, PE integrated. Uh, uh, sa English. Paano na-integrate sa English? Yung nga, okay, sa suggestive. Meron siya sa motivation niya. Ang bibigay siya ng mga... Ang laki yung words. Then, yeah. nakita ko doon sa... Yung mira si naman, uh, determine the, the temperature so that the temperature should be expressed in numeric. Kaya, uh, kaibigay siya sa ano pero sa man. So, implied na yun, ma'am, ayun na? Hindi na kailangan sabihin, oh, ito, pang ma, oh, ito, na, pang ano. Yeah. Implied na lang. Oh. Tinignan mo lang. Oh, okay. Kasi, ano, lagay na ka ng rating doon. Yan, tinignan mo lang naman doon. Seven. Sige po. Okay, objective 2. Okay, thank you, Ma'am Ellen. Objective 2 naman ay, ang okay, kailangan ay mayroon kayong ano, use trains of teaching strategies that enhance what? That enhance learner achievement in literacy and numeracy. Okay, so, literacy and numeracy naman ito. So, ano yung attachment ko? Si OT pa rin. Okay, si OT or inter-observer. So, kung pagbinigay ng observer sa iyo ay 7, standing ka, at 6, 4. Okay, so, anong attachment nyo? Ang attachment nyo is si only rating, rating sheet, ang lesson plan pa rin, kaya din instructional materials na may kinalaman saan? Okay, instructional materials na may kinalaman sa literacy and numeracy. Ano nga example nito sa science? Literacy. Ang sinabi ganyan yung mga class ito, yung sa temperature, literacy, ah, yan, numeracy. Okay, ah, yes. Problem solving. Analysis. Ah, 
uh, yung panit square panit square you differentiate this two so yung uh, ano doon yung kerasin na dito na tapos yun yung merasin yung ratio Opo. ang pinaka na dito yung merasin yung pag-solve no mm -hmm. uh, kung <coughs> how many um, how many uh, tawag dito Ah. Uh, but it's the volume of gas. Ganon, but it's the volume. Yeah. 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 It should be what? Literacy and numeracy. Okay, so literacy and numeracy. Okay, so yun po yun. So same attachment. Okay, then na objective 3. Ano naman ito? Si Oti pa rin. Sabi niya, Okay, apply, arrange, and teaching strategies to develop critical and creative thinking as well as higher order thinking skills. So I have. Okay, hats. Okay, so, sa COP nyo, kailangan itaro na may hats. Okay, yung higher order thinking skills. Okay, so, yan na yun. Okay, then, ang gagawin nyo, mamaya, bibigyan kayo ng, ano, ng limang elon ng form. Okay, so, ito po yun ang gagawin nyo. So, lalagyan nyo ng timeline. Okay, so, dito kung kailan nyo ginawa. Okay, then, MOB presented. Lalagyan nyo dito kung anong sinabit nyo. Kung anong meron kayo pa na. Kung anong meron kayo, COP. Okay, wala pa pang portfolio, Ma'am Elon. Kasi ang sabi, ang portfolio, ano pa eh? Uh, sa one week before graduation or after. After na. Uh, so, wala mo ng portfolio. Ano lang muna? Pasalita lang muna. Ano na yan? Plus yung rating. Okay, kung anong binigay, yun na yung rating na. Okay, so... Ito yung tra, objective, timeline, kung kailan nangyari. Tapos, MOB lalagay. So, yan, as is na yan, sa ibang, sa ibang gagawin. Okay, so, any questions po regarding tra 1? Ay, yung, uh, yung sinasabi mo sa HATS, diba? Dapat Opo. na iaanan natin yung sa number 8? Yeah, number 8. HATS. Number 3. Yeah, okay, so, dito, uh, paano mo nga ba may i-imply no, yung paano mong magagawa yung pag-develop ng higher order thinking skills. Madali lang po magbigay ka lang ng thought-provoking ng questions. Uh, pag nagtanong mag-isog yung bata, mag-iisog. So, yung thought-provoking, ibig sabihin, so, you are developing the higher thinking skills of the student. So, it means... Mag-isip ka lang, ng, ano, mag ka lang, mag ka lang ng question na yung bata ay mapipilitan mag-extract sa mind niya para masagot yun. Ah, ang ay ang open ended open ended Okay, hats po is house or wise. Okay, pero ang ano po natin dito ay kailangan makita sa DLL. Okay, present po dapat yung inyong hats. Saan yung sulit nila ang hats? Okay, kaya engage na yung sulit na motivation. Generalization. Generalization. Pwede rin application. Pwede rin sa iPad. I guess, kahit saan naman na. Pwede rin exit ticket. Pero ang pinakano niya is during engage time or motivation. Okay, then application. Okay, then ano pa ba? Generalization pwede rin. Pero ang generalization hindi na. Kasi i-degenerize sila ang nila yun eh. Okay, so any question po? Wala na? Okay, this time, ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome. Okay, so, napakasipag, maasaman. Okay, magaling. Okay, uh, okay, uh, okay uh, napakagaling na ating master teacher one from the senior high school. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome on the floor. Mom, pass this time.
Natutong na daw sila. Ako po sinamarize ko na, no? Pwede kong papasok ang outing. Pwede kong papasok ang outing.